Hey guys, welcome to Outgoing Gaming. I'm Brian Swan, joined today with Mark Warren. And we're playing a game that has gotten better as it age, sort of like fine wine. Apparently I don't I don't drink that stuff, but apparently like fine wine, Mario <laughs> Kart 8. Me neither. So we're under we're under eight. We're under the influence of eight. We're under, we're under the, the age of influence. Yeah. So um yeah, Mario Kart 8. Um, I remember looking at this um, and doing a sort of impression review. It's on Digital Gamers oh, Network. Um, I don't have internet. Like, cool. Yeah. This was just like my, um... Oh, cool. Yeah. Let's just, let's just yeah. think of the battle. I will have to think of the battle, but, you know. Battle's still bad. I'm still waiting for, like, in the... I added... I'm surprised I haven't added, like, a battle track yet. Like, an actual, like, you know, battle map for the track. We're going to 200cc because... Oh, oh, because I don't really... Okay. Because we're retarded. Really? Oh, okay, all right. Fine, we're gonna we're gonna do verses then. We're gonna do so we can take a tricky track. Okay, that sounds. Um, gonna be the black Yoshi. Of course. Now I remember when this first came out. I was thinking um, as I choose my character here. I was th I was remembered um, how it just sort of felt like it wasn't an an upgrade as much in terms of like because Sonic and Sega also Edition kind of Sonic has come out. It didn't seem like a really worthy purchase, um, and then they started adding all this additional content. Man, you can play as Link, and that's what I'll do right now. Um, you can play as Link, like really, as Link, and um, in this game, like that. Yeah. That's fantastic. That you can play is, as a villager. I mean, this is just excellent. The amount of stuff that they've added in like the past um, couple of months has gone above and beyond what I expected from um, Mario Kart. Yeah. Which made it all the more disappointing when they did announce, like, pack 3, 4, a 3 this year. Yeah, true. Because, you know, be, yeah, you're right. Because, um, I think about it now, you know, Mario Kart 8 should have gotten at least some sort of mention there. Yeah, there's, like, a lot more amiibo costumes now and everything. Really? Hmm? Yeah. Huh. Oh, you mean in the game? Yeah, amiibo costumes. Oh. Okay. Uh, when, uh, for your me. So, like, uh, when I scan my Sonic figure, I have a Sonic costume for my me. When I scan my Mega Man figure, I have a Mega Man costume for my Wii. Gotcha. Need a dragster for Mario. NBA. Mario Kart DS. <laughs> no teams. You can go 150. Yeah, easy CPU. Things. We're gonna do 200. Oh, okay, I got nothing. Oh, yeah, I just thought that, you know, after, um, well after Mario Kart 7, like, we saw that Mario Kart 7 had gone with the, the boat, like, the fact that you can, you can go underwater, the fact that you can go above ground and fly, um, and then Sonic and Sega also, also just transformed, I remember, like, we started, we played that, and man, that was a cool game, and it still is a cool game, it's one of the coolest games, you can buy that for the, free. The weird thing about Sonic and Sega also has racing transform is, I think I kind of like that game better. Yeah. Because I, uh, because I just had a lot more single player content. Gotcha. Because, like, this one is very... This game is as good as it is, as polished as it is, it's very lackluster in content. You know you can buy Sonic and Sega All-Star Edition Transformed on um, iOS devices for free, right? Mm -hmm. For free. And it's all, it's almost yeah, a full I'll, experience. Okay. Like, it's almost like the DS experience. You just don't yeah, have an yeah, on the iOS, though. No, you don't have an iOS. Wait, Transform? Are you talking about Transform? Transform. Oh. Yeah, you can buy... And it's... Oh, man. Ah, darn it. You remember how to play? Of course I remember it's how on to play. 200 CC! Yeah! Gonna be going fast as shit! Ah, uh, yeah. I'm gonna... Then curl. <laughs> Prawn to point! Remember, kids, don't go 87 miles per hour in your local freeway. It's not safe for other people driving around. Right now I'm playing as a Black Yoshi and... And I'm playing Bro as, uh... Blink. As Blink, yeah. Oh, you're in first place, surprisingly. Apparently, I don't understand. Maybe it's because it's a circle. But, oh, no, second place. Oh, no. Just, just lap. Yeah, I'm not right. You know, I haven't played, uh, I've never played 200cc before. This is the first time that I'll be used to 200cc or playing 200cc. But, yeah. Uh, this is, this some, is just, some tracks are built. No, no, some... this is, this is just because of the fact that it's a circle. So, like, this is, that's probably the only reason why I'm, like... The thing about 200cc is some tra uh, some tracks work with it. Some tracks really do not work with 200 CC because, like, they weren't built with 200 CC in mind. Of course, obviously. Yeah, I would expect um, that, like, because, um, like, uh, some tracks is like too hard to make turns. I mean, I'm sure the airport still works well, right? 
Giant, yeah. It's like, because they have pretty wide, like, well, some turns are pretty wide, right? Yeah. Hey, look at that comeback you made. You just got, yeah. like, you went back to first place. By the time I got from first to, like, eighth, you were just, like, finish line and finished that whole thing up. That it was, was only uh, Baby Park. Pretty fast, yeah. Your turn to choose. Oh, yeah. All right. Where is it? Okay. Let me see. Uh, let's see. Uh, Alright, Mark doesn't realize it, but I'm going to cause a lot of chaos here. I knew you were going to pick that track somehow. What track? It's the biggest track to pick on 200cc. It is the worst Super NES, Super NES Rainbow It is the worst track. Okay, I already made a joke to everyone. I love this track on Mario Kart Star. It's beautiful. This is going to be messy. I know it's going to be messy. But, um, it looks better on here. It's just like... Yeah, it looks... Fuck. Yeah. I just gotta keep a constant pace. I'm just gonna remember, I'm just gonna do what I do on 7. I think I'll... It'll, it'll, it'll carry over and work as well as it should. Oh my god. Shit. <laughs> that works. Sort of. Oh man, I cannot make too much... I can't make really wide drifts in this or it's just gonna be over for me. Whoa, that was close. Hi! Fuck! Fuck! Somebody just bumped me off the stage. <laughs> yeah, it, like, no, like, I remember, um... The one thing is that when you, when you have the track and you're used to the track and you get into the track groove, you get used to it. But then, like, immediately, like, when you start losing grits with, with, the tra with this track in particular, it, like, better, it just gets really bad. This track is fine on, like, uh, on, it's not, it, this is not built for 200cc. Definitely not. It's fun. It's, it's still fun. I still find it a little bit enjoyable. Or very enjoyable. But, like, oh, man, it's just, the fact that you can just fall off so quickly. Whoa! All right, come on, come on, come on! Damn, boots wildly, wildly on this track. Well, here. you can't do any. You can't like move at all on this track without like risking a lot. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Get to go a little faster. Ah. Come on, come on! World is all over. Ah, really? Are you kidding me? You chose this. Ah. Fine, so that's what I'll go with. So. All right. I have, I have a, I have a, I have a um car with too much speed on me, so. I, I think honestly, Link would be mad at me with my, with my, with my car. I, I gave, I gave Link something that looks like a Toyota Corolla. So we're finishing up the bullet bill. Oh wow! I, I gained. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. like um, Sonic and Sega Ultra Racing Transformed on um, on my iPod. It's actually pretty fun. I had to get used to I had to get used to the uh, the no uh, analog stick, but like it's still like it's almost the the game experience. It's almost the the thing is it's free and it's almost the game experience, like the full game experience. That's the crazy part about it. Like, and that's amazing. Um, because you'd expect something like really bad or really like four in terms of quality, but this really delivers. Have Mark choose the stage. Alright, let me fuck with you too. I'm gonna fuck with you right now. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Is that Ribbon Road? Yes. One well, of my favorite DLC stage from Pack 2. Gotcha. This is just like, it's Toy Story. <laughs> and What if Woody made an appearance? It would be cool. It would be cool and really weird that Nintendo would like what to do. Remember to buy your Disney Infinity packs instead of the Nintendo um, Amiibo. What? You didn't say anything. Just that fun. Probably gonna make crossover like Skyline is good. Fuck! Oh, oh shit! I think that might have been me. Oh no, no. Hey, dude. Whoa, alright. Come on. 
Yeah, in 200 sleep, you actually have to make use of the break button. You got jizz all over your screen. Oh shit, you're you're not you're you're behind me, so it doesn't, it doesn't fly. Never mind. <laughs> a terrible, terrible substitute. It just, there's no description. It's terrible. Do you think my wife will be Ah! Has that voice made a comeback in Spongebob recently? I, I don't know. I haven't, like, watched, I haven't watched it either. I watched the movie. That was pretty damn good. That's, that's the last actually I've seen in Spongebob. I haven't actually it's watched the, the series at all. I might want to watch the show. I might want to watch Nickelodeon. Well, it's you know, one, I think it's like the highest rated show right it's, now. It's it's one, one, the highest rated uh, yeah. channel, unfortunately. No, nobody with a brain want to watch Nickelodeon. That's true. They, just, they will, they will watch Harvey Beak and then just turn it off after that. Oh, yeah. Yep. Or they go to the obviously no quality uh, Cartoon Network. Yeah. I just, I know we're gonna do this on a podcast, but like, I just remember like. We used to, like, have to, like, fight over which one. Not, like, we wouldn't fight over, but, like, I would have to, like, fight over my brain. Like, what do I want to watch? Like, Nickelodeon or Cartoon Network? Like, like, and both had, like, really good programming on. It's like, oh, should I go with, should I go with this or that? Or this or that? Like, they'd, like, really, like, go down to, like, the nitty-gritty of, like, what do you want to watch? Like, because they both had good shows. And, like, now they don't have really good shows. But you got, um, you got in the fourth place. Overtook me. Gosh darn it. And now I have to choose a track that... May benefit me. Yes. Yeah. See, look, this has been going on for like 12 minutes now. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. Doesn't feel like it. But it's our final race right now for this game. It's like this kind of. It's like a DJ in game time, I guess. Yep. Oops. Press OK now. What? Huh? Oh. Thank you. I forgot what track you chose. Uh, Mario <laughs> Circuit. Oh, the Game Boy one. I like a lot, I like what they did. They have a lot of Game Boy advanced uh, tracks from here in the, uh, uh, from, uh, it's from Mar the Game Boy one is called Mario Kart Super Circuit. And that one is shit. Well, I love the, uh, Mar I lo no, I love Mario Circuit 2. Super Circuit. I like, uh... No, it, that's, uh, that's what the, uh, no, that's what the Game Boy one is called. Oh. They remixed all the, uh, Game Boy, they remixed a lot of the Game Boy track um, on the No, no, like, what's that one that, what's the one that was on, uh, no, Mario Kart, no, Mario, um, Circuit 2 on the, uh, it was on, it was on 3 ds but it was G GBA, I believe. No, I, I don't know what I'm talking about, the GBA game. Oh. Uh, the, uh, GBA game was shit. Oh, there was yeah. only one GBA. It, fucking tire! It's only one GBA game. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, do you see the Spider-Man movies much? I don't know. Uh, we didn't we have a podcast about this? I yeah, really you, you haven't seen. Sorry. Yeah. Has that podcast been uploaded? Huh? Podcast been uploaded already? It was with, um... Kevin? The, uh, Spider-Man podcast? I don't know if it was, bro. Yeah. Anyway, I like, uh, the, uh, I like the Super Nintendo Mario Kart better than the GBA one, because the GBA one is just shit. Gotcha. gotcha. Oh, yeah, the SNES, um, no, I like, yeah, that's, uh, that's what it was. The SNES Mar uh, Mario Kart, too. I enjoy, I enjoy that one. A lot. I'll play time trial uh, and uh, in on uh, seven and just you know spend so much time on it. Oh, it's probably good given this one. Uh, Link can now have a reason to smile on his freedom. Wow. 
black UFC. And the other made the third or fourth place in the top three. You said what? Nero's made the top three. Yeah. Just for a hack, we're gonna we're gonna do one more race. Yep. Versus What's your favorite Mario Kart like on launch in general? Like, I mean, I didn't, I haven't gotten any game on any Mario Kart game on launch, but like the game that I enjoy most is Seven, which is DS hands down. DS hands down. Gotcha. The uh, DS has had like a had a really fun mechanic. I, it was like a, it was just really fun. It was a really solid Mario Kart game. Gotcha. Or one of the most solid. have good handling let's do it no but um i just i enjoyed seven because like it sort of took the like what we thought of carding and sort of moved it forward like what he said. Okay. well like, like from what i played of it didn't really do much with the new uh with the new carding mechanic with a new diddy kong racing mechanic right? um yeah because like, like like i did like i said um if you look at um my review it's on digital games not what it's what it's like, like what i said was that like it it and what I think is that, like, it has these new mechanics, like, with, but especially for fr for flying, like, you can only do very, like, very little with it, and they sort of, like, force you in this one direction for a very limited time that you're in that sort of flying or water atmosphere, so there's no real sort of enjoyment of being underwater. Or it, it's, uh, Mario Kart 8 does more with it, the uh, new mechanic, with new Diddy Kong racing ass mechanics. Yeah, I'm, um, yeah, I would it, expect that. And it, like, and it actually, and, it, and it, even... On top of that, it adds another element, anti-gravity. Oh, man. So, like, it, it has, like, four elements to work with, and, and that's pretty cool. They got one heck of a job to follow up with in, um... Mario Kart 9? Mario Kart 9. I, think that, I still think that, you know, the next Mario Kart is just going to be called Mario Kart, and that, you know, it's just going to be like, okay, it's going to be called Mario Kart, and Mario Kart will be a great karting game. I doubt they'll do that, but I think the next Mario Kart will probably have, like, a shit ton of crossovers. Yep. Don't get, get ready for that platoon re reference. Possibly. I, mean, I see more of, like, Kirby and shit. Oh, definitely. I would love to see Kirby. And more returning characters. Because uh, there was a lot of taken out, uh, Mark Harker that was taken out in, in previous ones. Oh, that got dang banana. Get away from me, too. With that dang banana. Oh, was that an attack I saw about that? Mm -mm. I was trying to, like, I was trying to boost off you. Like, I didn't, had no idea how close to the edge I was. I also love the, the amount of variety in the, in the um, car selection this time. Like, there was definitely, like, a large variety of, like, cars to choose from in Mario Kart 7, but... There's like just this awesome amount of um, custom, like, it's not that, I'm sorry, let me change what I was saying, um, no. How the cars look, and the, the references and the cameos that we see in the cars, like Mercedes Benz, and just, and not, not even that, but like just, the cars in general, oh my gosh, get away from me, get the hell away from me, don't even, there's a blue shell in there. There's a blue shell somewhere, isn't there? Mm -mm. Oh wow. I fell off again. Yeah, I'm just amazed at all the references that it makes. It's um, and just the amount of car selection that you have going for it. Yeah. I think uh, oh, Mario Kart Nine had like has to be some um. I don't think it probably is gonna be a new mechanic. It's just, like gonna progress what like Mario Kart Nine, what Mario Kart Eight did, and just like have have different physics. Gotcha. Just like have more crossovers, more tracks. I still think they're gonna keep expanding on this one. 
No, it would be senseless for them. To, it would be crazy for them not to keep expanding this. Because, I mean, they've been doing great in terms of what they've added. She was one already. Alright, that's what I'm doing. Making the file size longer. That was the one that was taking all day deciding what car to choose from. Now, on the second time around, bitch, you were taking, <laughs> you were taking longer. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I need to have a caliber of automobile, which is perfect. That's a cartoon! <laughs> that cause. Remember when um, Evolution Studios came out on the PlayStation 4 reveal event? It was like, we've been waiting so long to reveal this game. We love cars. Oh, yeah. We love them so much that we're going to hold this game off two years after launch. And then not reveal that there's a, actually a PS Plus, and then reveal the PS Plus position, and not release that for two and a half years either. We love you guys, and we love COD, but man, are we fucking good. Man, are we dipshits or what? <laughs> we could just made a new motor storm. Nope, we decided to make this. Smart move. Seriously, though, like, they could have made a new motor storm. For PS4. I am quite surprised. They, they have a lot of old IPs they need to make more games for. No, I mean, but Evolution Studios themselves were the creators of Motorstrung. So, like, I'm, I was so surprised when, like, they just went and they did, um, this. This? They made, no, not more, no, not more. <laughs> okay, you just, you, more, just, you said this. I was like, what the hell they made this? No, like, Evolution Studios, like, because they, when they went and created, uh, Gosh, my brain's squeezing up for some reason. When they created Drive Club, I'm like, usually they're they're they've done something better than just, just that. You know, they they their games that they make are above and beyond what any other team has made. In terms of crazy, out fucking cows, outrageous like racing games. You know? And, yeah. Like, I'm really surprised, like that they went away from that because it's just such a part of a it's it Motorstorm was like the was the PlayStation 3's like cool crazy racing game um like franchise and then we have Drive Club come out and that's just like a sort of arcade Gran Turismo and yeah you could have done a better job and they could have just made, oh but that was I'm not gonna keep looking back at the motor at Motorstorm, but it was it was a really cool cool franchise. Motorstorm was, you know. Yeah, it was. Uh, especially Apocalypse. Yeah, it was. I think we're going to like that game better. It's going on me. Now for the tiebreaker. <laughs> I was thinking about going to the airport, but then like I was like, oh well, everyone does um does the airport. So, let's keep from being a good track. No, no, I'm not saying it's a bad track. I'm just. Like, oh, oh yeah. let's let them variety. Uh, oh, no, I'm not, I'm not bad trying. I'm just trying to be a hipster. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's why you have the, the purple card and the purple and the black Yoshi. I'm trying to say you don't like black Yoshi. <laughs> I'm not discriminatory about, about Yoshi. I will, I will um, get that woolly Yoshi when it comes to North America. The, the Yoshi, the wool Yoshi me Oh uh, yeah, I'm definitely getting one of those. Uh, I'm gonna eat, like... As, as the sequel me said, um, uh, sorry, as the sequel me said, it's so fluffy I want to die. Ah, shit! What happened? That green, that red shell. Oh. It hit! My green shell! Oh man, that sounds terrible. Who would do such a thing? Firing at, firing! Ah, damn it! It happened again! <laughs> ah, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Don't go away, these cows! These real fast cows! Don't fly well! Oh, shit! Yeah, Mario Kart! Well, all these all these game stages, like, uh... This game, like, yeah, I could see why... It, Mar it is my favorite Mario Kart. Under they, DS. No, it's my, fa it's my favorite Mario Kart game. This is my favorite Mario Kart game, period. Well, because I'm new to the, to the franchise, um, 
I mean, even when I had, even when I got played N64 at my grandma's house as a kid, like I didn't know about Mario Kart whatsoever. So, like my my memories of racing were Crash Team Racing, and that's it. I faintly remember Kirby's Air Ride at a friend's house, but Kirby's Air Ride is like a weird version of F Zero. But well, like you, everybody plays that game for the trial. So I love it. But... Yeah. But yeah, I just remember that as a kid. And so I didn't know anything about like, oh, there was an, and there was a Mario Kart 64, there was a uh, Wii version. I didn't even know like about the Wii like until, or maybe I did. I don't. It was, I don't remember much about like the Wii at all. I, I was like a kid, and like I didn't really get researched up into it until about like a couple of years ago. So yeah. Never mess with me on my track, boy. I, should, I wish I had like a blue shell this right before, <laughs> like you got there. You, I wish you had. You probably would have wished you had that invincibility start early before I crossed the finish line. Yes, I do. Uh, I win the tiebreaker. Very nice. Very very nice. We'll come back to this game when we have more people, ladies and gentlemen. Definitely, yeah. Yeah, Mario Kart is a really fun game. Yeah, look at it. Look at it. So, my trophy, Brian. And Mark made love to it. Yeah. And he had children off of this. Yeah. My trophy, Brian. It's my golden trophy. I'm going to put yeah, it on my. Grab it. I'm going to put it on my shelf, but yeah, I can't because it's it. virtual. Uh huh. Yeah. How's <laughs> that virtual trophy tape? <laughs> Good night, everybody. All right, guys. Thanks for listening. <laughs> Thank you for listening to that last part. Yeah, <laughs>